precious girl. You're just small time. That's a cold hearted bitch right there. Liberty City is in shock today as the police and emergency services deal with the aftermath of a devastating attack on a police convoy this morning. As yet, no details have been released about the prisoners being transferred in the convoy, and no group has claimed responsibility. The convoy left police headquarters early this morning for a routine transfer of felons to Liberty Penitentiary. The attack took place on the Callahan Bridge, leaving few witnesses and the bridge itself severely damaged. Some of the convicts are thought to have perished in the explosion that followed the initial attack. Revelations as to the professionalism of the attack struck police hours afterward when identification of the missing felons were further hampered by an attack by computer hackers on police headquarters databases. With the Porter Tunnel Project falling behind schedule, this disaster leaves Portland isolated from the rest of the city. Come on! Senor Dickhead! It's no problem to kill you. You gonna be sorry. Aye, aye, get lost. I know a place on the edge of the red light district where we can lay low. But my hands are all messed up, so you better drive, brother. My hands are all messed up. Proceeds to open the door himself. This is Head Radio Love Media Station. Just one. Hey, man, buddy. Welcome to the stream. This is the place right here. Let's get off the street and find a change of clothes. I love that they still open the doors the way they used to, just throw it in. Let's go around the back and use the service door. Wait here, man, while I go in and talk to Luigi. Say hello to April, ladies. April's got some business upstairs. Well, maybe you could do me a favor. 
One of my girls needs a ride, so grab a car and pick up Misty from the clinic, then bring her back here. Remember, no one messes with my girls. So keep your hands on the wheel. If you don't mess this up, maybe there'll be more work for you. Now get out of here. Okay, the poles are indestructible in this game. I didn't say we're game. I just make the same noise as San Andreas. It's like that. Luigi said to, to give you this, so here, here, take it. This is a new high on the street. Goes by the name of Spank. Some wise guy's been introducing this trash to my girls down Portland Harbor. Go and introduce a bat to his face. Then take his car, respray it. I want compensation for this insult. Try 
anything on here does not resemble GTA 5 at all. I guess whoever said that was full of it. Feels more like GTA 4, honestly. Except GTA 4 was a little bit. Maybe he won't notice. What am I saying? Of course he's gonna notice. Just tell me it was like that when I found it. Hey, you said respray it, not fix any damage that I already found. I had it on a combo. What am I gonna do? Wait. Hey, 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 I gotta talk to you. Alright, Mick, I'll talk to you later. How you doing, kid? The Don's son, Joey Leone. He wants some action from his regular girl, Misty. Go pick her up at Hepburn Heights, but watch yourself. That's Diablo Turf. Then run her over to his garage in Trenton and make it quick. Joey ain't the kind you keep waiting. Remember, this is your foot in the door. So keep your eyes on the road and off Misty. You know, I I wasn't gonna do anything to Missy, but since he keeps insisting that I don't, I think I'm going to out of spite now. I don't like being told what to do. Just for just for that, I'm not gonna focus on the road at all. I'm just gonna be staring her down the entire time. That's the real question. I'll be with you in a minute, Spark Plug. Hey, I'm Joey. Luigi said you were reliable, so come back later. There might be some work for you. All right? Later. Hey, I'm bored. When are you gonna drill me? A few inches later. I got a little job for you, pal. The Ferrelli brothers have owed me money for too long, and they need to be taught some respect. Lips Ferrelli is stuffing his oh, fat yeah. face in the St. Mark's Bistro, so steal his car take it to Eight Ball's bomb shop up in Harwood. You know Eight Ball, right? Once he's fitted it with a bomb, go park the car where you found it. Then sit back and watch the whole show. But hurry up, oh. you will be forever. Okay.
I wasn't even planning on the other car. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That was mine. Wasn't it? <laughs> it was because I was part of cricket. Ah, that's what I get. I had that count.